sir. <laughs> that vehicle is traveling four miles above the posted speed limit. That's Mr. Rubio. Lot on his mind. Wife's about to have another baby. We'll let him slide this time. But, sir, isn't it our duty to uphold the law? Better for everybody when we uphold it with compassion. Now that we can pursue. Team, I need backup. Sorry, Cody. You're gonna be a little late to school. Ha! <sighs> oh! Everyone out of that house. my move. A routine patrol with four bats and stasis. He's laid on a poke in the strangest of places. Earth was their home now and in addition. Optimus Prime gave them this mission. Learn from the human, serve and protect. Live in their world, earn their respect. Family of heroes will be your allies. Two others remain robots in disguise. Roll to the rescue. A hero. Another rescue bot? Did you know about this, Dad? Cool! Where did it come from? We don't know, and it could be hostile. Rescue bots surround... Surround nothing! That thing just saved my house, and I want to know who to thank. <laughs> that would be whom to thank, Mr. Mayor. And the answer would be me, Dr. Morocco. Uh, what brings you back to Griffin Rock, Doctor? Why, my great love for this little community, of course. And this time, I come bearing gifts. Black market sales for your junk tech have slowed down, huh? I know not of what you speak, young lady. I build sensible devices for legitimate businesses, like my new breed of rescue robot. It single-handedly does the work of your entire squad. I do hope they're made of recyclable parts. Hey, listen, Doc. Our robots aren't getting scrapped. You can't just barge in here with unproven technology. I... You're right, young man. My Morbot needs to prove itself. So I propose a test. Your robots against mine. Surely there's nothing more fair than that. Appreciate the offer, Doctor. But last time you paid us a visit, your tech proved to be both dangerous and uncontrollable. That's why Doc Green was hired instead of you. I've heard the good Doctor has been sacked. Sad, really. It's not Doc's fault. Someone hacked the mainframe and then stuck a virus into the... Ah, the faith of an innocent child. The point remains, my Morbot can handle the unpredictable better than your current team of machines and humans. Mayor, please. Says who? You can't, you can't talk to us like that. Enough! Chief, you and Dr. Morocco come to the city council meeting this afternoon. I can't make any important decisions without pants. Hey, Frankie! Shh! Sorry, Mrs. Niederlander. He doesn't run a very friendly bed and breakfast. I'm worried about Daddy. He says he's fine, but I don't believe it. Uh, Cody? Chief, good afternoon. My unexpected vacation has proven so valuable. I took up a new hobby. 
making birdhouses. It's not really that challenging. Doc, Morocco's back. He's trying to get rid of the rescue bots and my family. Now, you say this robot can do the work of an entire rescue team? In any emergency, all by itself. And because my Mobot does not require a human handler, it completely eliminates any misplaced empathy or human error. It eliminates my team. With all due respect, Council, my family and our bots have kept Griffin Rock remarkably safe. At great risk to your own lives. Morbot would put the Burns family out of harm's way. We know danger is part of the job. There's no reason to replace us. I'm so sorry. I thought this town welcomed advanced technology. I'd better give my robot to a more sophisticated city. Yes! Uh, ju just a second, Doctor. Uh, Griffin Rock will try your more bot. If it can safely do the work of Chief's team, I'm sure they'll happily uh, step aside. Mr. Mayor, I do not... Your bots replace dozens of vehicles, Chief. Progress marches on. All in favor? Starting tomorrow, the Morbot will assist in all emergencies. May the best bot win. They can't do this. What are we supposed to do with one emergency vehicle? Share it? Won't be a problem. The town's dumping us, too. This job is about keeping people safe. No way one robot can protect an entire island. Just because I don't like flying doesn't mean I want to be grounded. <laughs> I guess everyone's replaceable. Nobody has been replaced. This is a contest, which we can win. Dad's right. What are we afraid of? The Morbot is a machine. Programmable metal. Your experienced thinking rescue bots. Against this team? That bucket of bolts doesn't stand a chance. It's go time. Rescue bots, roll to the rescue. done faster if we all work together. Uh. Not open for debate. Heat wave, can you handle the explosives? We have it. Move, Kate. Bots aren't as fragile as humans. Uh. Hey! We have company. And not the friendly neighbor kind. Apparently, the Morbot correctly observed that his assistance is not needed. Not much for subtlety, is it? Or safety. Banging those crates around could have set off the explosives. Ugh, and look at this mess. Littering. That robot can expect a citation in the mail. 
You can also expect headlines. Huxley Prescott reporting live. That's one for the Morbot, zero for the home team. Can the Burns family still cut it? Are the rescue bots rescue knots? Stay tuned for more exclusive Morbot action. Who wants to watch a brainless robot? There's no way it's better at our jobs than we are. Except for the time when it just was. Better than you? No way. Sure, Morbot put out the fire, but it caused even more problems doing it. A machine's no match for real heroes. I'll show you. This is the story of John Henry. He worked on the railroad, using only his hammer. I feel reassured already. One day, a machine showed up to replace him, so John Henry challenged it. Whoever could get the job done first would win. You sure you're not making this up? John Henry worked as hard as he could, and he beat that machine with the strength of his arms and the power of his mighty heart. So he got to keep his job? Uh, yeah, something like that. The end. Then we need to work harder. We'll show that mindless robot exactly who it's up against. I had one just like this when I was your age. Here you are, young man, ready for blast off. It's tail. No, this one's mine. Watch where you're going, Graham. I was. That's why Boulder told you to move. Guys! Morbot's here! Another victory for the challenger, and another defeat for our rescue bots. Bested by a child's toy, makes you wonder if our town has ever been safe with the Burns family at the helm. You don't really believe that. Hey, what I believe in is a good story, and this is a great story. I don't get it. The bot should have had that. Something's fishy about that rocket. Dr. Morocco. Dad, I think I know what made that rocket go out of control. Can we talk later, Cody? My hands are kind of full here. Frankie, something weird is going on with Morocco. Can I come over? Sure thing, Cody. As soon as we get back to Miss... Ah! I thought I fixed this! Crazy. 
Dad. Doc Green's solar car is on the Fritz again. Frankie says they're on Russell Street. Did you hear that, team? Great. Another chance for Hot Shot Bot to kick our... Kate, there are eight of you and one of him. If you all work together, you have a huge advantage. Remember, this isn't about showing up another robot. Our first and only priority is keeping people safe. Compassion, sir. It's what makes us good at our jobs. You bats will save us. Hope Huxley got that on camera. Oh, thank you. I have no idea what got into my car. You covered the solar panels. Remove the backup battery. The car has no source of power. There's no explanation for it. Oh, of course there is. You! Your tech is a menace to our society! Mr. Mayor, thank goodness you're unharmed. Oh, I shudder to think what would have happened if my Morbot hadn't been on hand to save City Hall. Save it? Do you not see the giant crater? Better here than in my office. What if there had still been people in that car? You are news, Huxley? Here it is. I'm hiring Dr. Morocco as Griffin Rock's lead scientist. This is so unexpected. All I can say is, I accept. Your tech came through when our town needed it most. Maybe you can clean up Doc Green's mess. You plan this. I don't know how, but I'll find out. Hmm. Children should really be seen and never be heard. Run along. And because the Morbot has proven it can protect Griffin Rock much better than our current team, Chief Burns and his rescue force will step down. What? No way! Why? Are you kidding? Mayor, please, look at the damage that robot caused. It doesn't think like a human. And your robots do? My family does. Oh. Your family needs to find new jobs. Heroes, indeed. Robot, patrol. 
do we do now? May I suggest birdhouses? I can't believe we were beaten by that gear-headed goon! We have failed this town and everyone in it. They failed us too, Chase. Chief said we wouldn't lose our jobs. Humans say a lot of things. Boulder, are you okay? I finished the book. Even though John Henry tried his hardest, his heart gave out in the end. That's how I feel, too. But you can't give up! Dr. Morocco did this! We'll figure out how to stop him! Okay, I know what you're trying to do, Cody. But we don't need cheering up. We need to be reassigned. A new mission. Somewhere else. No! You don't! Hey, Frankie. Cody, guess what? Dad just examined what's left of our car. And he found something awfully familiar inside. <laughs> <laughs>